Award-winning Nigerian disc jockey and producer DJ Neptune is setting records and standards as he releases Nobody, the extended playlist, which features 12 new remixes of his Afro-pop smash Nobody um, with Mr. Easy and Joe Boy. Speaking on the project, he said, quote, Nobody is one of the year's biggest Afrobeat hits, so it was only right for me to reach out to different amazing artists that are leaders in the territory they are coming from and make it truly a worldwide affair. Mm. Let's make it 11. Let's do our, our, our remix. Uh, hey. Oh, we're not just shoes, but it's okay. Okay, <laughs> let me start rapping. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, you feel me? with. Oh, yeah. Elsa, yeah, your turn. I rapped it. I rapped it to show you. Uh, well, have you seen that meme? Um, di, di, ga, ga, di, ga. Have you seen it? Oh, my gosh. Oh, right. if, uh, I know you no, have reservations. But Just let's get to it. <laughs> If you only watch, okay. Are we, I'm what do you? I'm no, we are done. What do you think about twelve remix? Of Wait, is it remixes? Yeah. Abi? Hey. Amazing body work. It's a definitely a good business strategy. It's definitely a welcome development. Being um, not not being a common thing for a lot of people yeah. to do. So I has I'm, anybody done it? I don't uh, think I, so. I, I, I wouldn't know. I can't say I don't that amazingly. So. But anybody in Nigerian space, yeah, yeah. in I Africa, can we can even go that far. Uh, yeah. Yes, no. This is a global remix. Um, sure. We have um, what's the sound that you were asking for? I'm a, I'm a, uh, I'm a piano, I'm a piano Latino, Latino sound. Yeah. I love the Igbo one though. Sorry, I'm local like that. Like yes, girl. Zoro. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So um, um, I think it's 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 a very good business strategy. In the sense that you get more international audience, you mm. get a lot of um, more people listening to your music because you have diverse people on your body of work. So I see that like that is amazing. And whoever is um, on DJ Neptune's management is killing it, man. Mm. Like, I mean, he just copied uh, what's that? I'm, I'm a running to the hotel road. I'm a right to rock nice. no more. He did the exact same thing. He took it to the countryside. He took it to the rap side. He did it with Nikki. He did all of that. So that's that. That, that strategy of, mm. of when you notice that a song is really big and the world isn't actually wanting it to die down, the next thing to do is to revamp it for each audience. So mm -hmm. that has been done before. Okay. Just, just not in this particular space. Okay. Either yeah. ways, it was yeah. still, I mean, it was still done really well. 12 songs. Like, well, the reason why I was even lot. going to his management is because um, we just saw the um, Big Brother that just got concluded. It was there all, all through the mm. season. And then, yeah, so I think they're doing a fantastic job. Then with this, it's like from one wing to another, from one yeah. wing to another. Do you think you can? And actually sit down to listen to that extended playlist from beginning to end. So, yes, I was going to get to that. Tired. I don't honestly, think it's supposed to be like a, that honestly, type of work. I don't think it's supposed to be the type of work where so you, you can't, listen. basically. I think you should I'm, choose your, choose yeah. your poison. I think that's what the body of work like. Mm. Choose what works for you. Because I personally, if I listen to one, it's over. You stop at four. Yeah, so I, I would rather go with the ones that sound completely different from what I'm used to, which mm. is the Ama Piano and the Trinidad and Tobago mm. one, because those ones totally sound, they sound a bit different. I think the way I would I'm listen to, to it is if I, I would listen to everybody's take, mm. not listen to the whole entire, nobody, yeah. nobody. I listen to Lake then I listen to Joe Boy, then I listen so to So we Mr. need a Easy. mix of a mix listen, right now. You Did you let you? Are you <laughs> listening? <laughs> Just go in and back to back to everything on everybody's take. No chorus. Okay, I need to pay us for that when you do it anyway moving on to the next story COVID-19 is vicious it's made me the most unwell I've ever been in my life and this is coming from Jason Njoko of Iroko TV as he shares recovery progress he took to his Twitter page on Saturday to share a photo of himself hmm. from 24th of October and another taking on the 7th of November he said quote finally leaving the hospital can barely walk more than 10 uh, minutes a time but I am now resting at home a long recovery Ahead. COVID nineteen. Are you crying for COVID nineteen? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so COVID nineteen <laughs> is, is still very real, guys. It is, man. Like I, I really don't know why a lot of people. Now I feel like that CNN reporter that started crying when Joe Biden won. I'm like, okay, is this for that. everybody? <sighs> is this for I people? Didn't tell you. That Where did I get these people from? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Um, mm. But for real. I'm but for real, for real, for real, for real. <laughs> COVID-19 is still out there. And um, I just don't want people to just throw it in the wind and be like, yeah, there's no more COVID-19 because mm -hmm. we are chilling and we are doing protests. Some well, people are tired. See, I, know, I, know they're, they're, tired. I think they're like mentally I fatigued, but we are have to keep doing what we're doing. people celebrating um, Joe Biden's win? Does it feel like the America that is, um, what's the word now? 
been destroyed. Sorry, not like mm. destroyed, but you get what I mean by COVID-19. I mean, I think Biden's people were seen to be, well, in the campaign that I watched, which was one of the clear differences, was that Biden's people were, had to wear face masks mm -hmm. for them to rally around. And then, for Trump, celebration. and then Trump's people, I don't really know. The ones that I've seen, some of them wear, some of them don't. I think it's really up to you on an individual level, like what you want to do with it. I, sometimes it's just nice to get reminded, and sometimes it's nice to be reminded through just words of encouragement or jingles. And then sometimes we really need examples like his mm -hmm. when he's sharing his experience. Like this man was really, really fit and mm -hmm. active. Yeah. and has done a lot to see him crippled on the wheelchair saying he cannot walk for with, with more than how many minutes loss. of time it's a, it's an eye awakener for me like I, I was saying this morning scary that um you know i did it i did too much because i was still in the i was still at the club till like what 3 a.m this morning mm, around mm, people Mary. like this is confession <laughs> so you know when i see that kind of thing i'm like this is really dangerous guys hey. like um although there was a lot of <laughs> there's, there's still a bit of like social distancing and we had to take face masks in and i was very very careful as like so, uh, like Personal you space and all that. I mean, no, no, tell me how you, mm. how you no. social. <laughs> no, just like my, uh, my seat, you uh, know, uh, my seat, uh, my seat. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, other people, you know, I, I just think we should. What, what's take away from the story is let's just still be guided, mm. really. Take care of yourself. But mm. well, you're not guided in the club. Ah, no, mm. I was guided. I was like, ah, social distancing. The number of hey. girl, the number <laughs> of the mic. <laughs> <laughs> but very quickly before we go, I mean, people are reacting to the um, Joe Biden win, and Tacha is saying it gives us hope. Does it really? Um, of course, she went on to say, get your PVC. We need to start working from now. Um, educate people around you. Know you know what? But what do you think about... I think Tacha should have stopped that. Get your PVC, guys. This is what they used in America. Mm. <laughs> or, look, you can't be proud of a system or you, you can't get hope from a system that functions in a country that the whole entire system is bollocks mm, but then she's, she's saying that we can start working for, from, for, from, it, for it from it, yeah. now yeah so that's why i, I said, think you can get, get hope from whoever you want to you want to get now, hope from um, i mean that's the whole idea of of hope in an, in a sense that well, you true, derive what true, you want to derive true, from it and, and i think I, I, I like that she she has an interest in that kind of thing and to hold on to hope right now i think is for her i, I would say it's a lot more wins because i'm losing my hope as, mm. as soon as i open social media and i'm seeing how much um, um tension is going upon the the protesters that were involved or still involved and people having their accounts frozen and their passports whatever mm. and they're all all that type of dramatic stuff i don't know if i say i have hope whether biden wins or trump wins so if she's gonna say that i'm i'm happy for her because I, I wish i okay, felt that way but please hope let's do the groundwork the get your pvc i heard registration starts um early next year and i'm gonna be there yeah so please let's all do what we have to do and that's our be power. prepared that's mm. the only power you have right now Thank you for watching and please do send your opinions via WhatsApp to 0906005719 or Twitter to us at Plus TV Africa. Remember, you can catch up on this episode and all our exclusive content by subscribing to our YouTube channel at Plus TV Africa. Also, watch your time on Aroto TV and in London on Ben Television. My thank you as always go to my interesting co-anchors, Ife Omai and Ife Oluwa Oshankeye and the entire production team. Thank you for watching Plus TV Africa's Tea Time. My name remains Elsie Godwin. Do stay safe. <coughs> Thank you.